Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've ever wanted to create a standout vintage jersey design for your team, a club, or maybe just for fun, you're in the right place. Today I'm going to walk you through step-by-step -step how to design a vintage-style jersey using Canva, and I promise by the end of this tutorial, you'll feel equipped to whip up your own creative and professional-looking jersey mock-ups. Let's jump right in, so the very first thing you want to do is open up Canva and head over to the Elements tab. This basically acts as your toolbox for all the visuals you'll need. In the search bar, just type in T-shirt mock-up. What you're looking for here is a good blank shirt template that you can use as your canvas. Think of it like laying out a fresh jersey on a table before you start decorating it. Go ahead and drag your favorite t-shirt mock-up onto your workspace. Take a second here to resize it or position it so you have enough room to work with. Don't worry too much about making it perfect right now, you can always tweak things as you go. Next up, we want to start building the actual design on the jersey, so pop back into Elements and search for jersey designs. Now here's your chance to be a little creative. Canva's library has patterns, stripes, sleeve accents, and other details that really give your jersey that vintage look. Imagine those old-school jerseys with bold stripes or unique sleeve cuffs. It's these little visual touches that set a vintage design apart. Drag and drop elements you like onto your mock-up. You can change colors to fit your style and rotate or layer them until it starts to look like something you'd actually want to wear. Take your time with this part, experimenting is part of the fun. If something doesn't look quite right, just delete it and try a different element. Remember, vintage jersey designs are timeless because of their simplicity, so don't feel like you need to overdo it. Now for the finishing touch, every great jersey needs a logo. Head back to Elements once more and search for jersey logos. You'll find lots of crest-style icons, classic sports symbols, and other graphics that would look right at home on the chest of a throwback jersey. If you already have a logo ready maybe for your school, club, or group, you can actually upload it right into Canva and position it wherever you want. This personalizes your design and really brings it all together. Adjust the size and placement until it feels balanced. There's no absolute rule here, just go with what looks good to you. Don't stress if it takes a few tries, even the pros play around with positioning before settling on the final look. So that's the basic process. As you play around with your own jersey design, don't be afraid to experiment or put your own spin on things. Honestly, this demo is meant to show you the ropes, but you can take it so much further. Add your own colors, maybe throw in some text with your team's name or a player number. The possibilities are endless, and I'm confident you can create something even cooler than my example. If you found this tutorial helpful, give it a thumbs up, and if you have any questions or want to share your creation, drop a comment below, I love seeing what you come up with. Don't forget to subscribe for more step-by-step -step Canva tutorials and creative design tips. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.